So, Mazar Fabulous Renee and Nene, another YouTuber, both were friends, they grew a friendship and it just completely fell apart and now they're both addressing it. I was thinking, Ra, who would ha why would someone hack your account? I was like, who do you think it is? She says to me, she thinks it's Vanessa. I was like, Vanessa's doing her thing with her music. Like, she looks like she's living her best life. Why would she have time to be hacking your account? Of someone hacking your account, why not say to me, to my face, say to me, oh, you hacked my account? It's a bit sticky, isn't it? Why didn't you, why didn't you say to my face, why did you hack my account? Did you hack my account? In fact, you said it was Vanessa that hacked your account. So with your story time about your sugar daddy, wait, <laughs> do people know that it was real? Your sugar daddy in the bar and the wife, <laughs> the wife came to the bar to fuck you up. Did you tell them lot the truth on that? Oh. Oh, you didn't tell them? Oh. You didn't tell them the truth about that sugar daddy's Oh, you're deep, you know. Did you even tell them the truth about even having sugar daddy? Oh, you're fucked. You're tapped. You're t you actually didn't tell them the truth about your sugar daddies that you had. The Indian guy that he wasn't real. Oh, I'm talking too much. All right. Hey guys, it's Maran Morali. Hopefully you guys are doing well today. Now, before we dive deep into this particular video and dissect, analyze what's going on and the, the different perspectives, be sure to definitely subscribe to my channel. Just click that button. I'd massively appreciate it. And follow me on Instagram, Murad underscore Murali, and let's get this started. Now, I stumbled across this on my timeline. This particular new YouTuber, Nene, is somebody who obviously, you know, did a story time video about how she found out that her, the person that she was seeing was obviously having sex with other guys, and it was obviously a massive storyline that kind of shook London. Everybody, yes, my Amazon purchases better come through. You know what? Let me, let me hold on. Sorry about that before. I just got excited because my packages came on time. I did not miss them. And today I'm drinking, for those who know, it may not look as appetizing, but I am drinking ginger tea with honey, with lemon, and whatever you're feeling in life, whatever kind of stress internally, bodily, ginger tea, if you know, just wipes it out. But yeah. May not taste as great, but Jesus, ginger tea is so good for you. Anyway, so these are two particular YouTubers we obviously know of Renee. If you're a subscriber of hers or of the whole Vanessa Renee kind of situation that took place, everybody knew of her back um, late last year. And you know, um, Nene obviously makes a video about it and she addresses the situation because she's confused because Renee is obviously speaking on live about her and she's very bemused as to why. they. She discussed how they had a friendship that was blooming because they were both in Turkey and different times and locations and they wanted to talk about the experiences and give it, give each other advice and you know it came to a point where she was helping Renee help edit videos and then um, they, she needed more space on the laptop so she obviously had to buy a hard drive. Renee gave her the £90, she came over, helped edit stuff and then obviously needed Renee's password to upload videos on her channel. And now obviously Renee is saying that this particular individual girl that she's gotten close to has hacked and so forth and gotten into her um, YouTube and Nene is actually very upset, infuriated and you know just reflects on the notion that she felt like she was set up, that the friendship was completely fake, that, um, and she also wanted to say that apparently Renee is faking her story times, and that half of them actually aren't true, she's doing them for views, and you know, it's just a bit confusing and alarming. Now, before we get into this, we can't really dissect and analyze it properly because we haven't really heard Renee's side of the story, and if you don't hear both sides of the story, you cannot come to a conclusion at all. There's one side, there's the other person's side, and there's a third side, which is the truth, which we obviously don't know. But she has expressed that she felt like Renee set her up, that she's fake, that she's annoying, that she's a liar when it comes to story time videos, that she obviously tricked her, set her up, to used her as for this conspiracy theory of her hacking into her stuff, and she showed receipts of you know purchases of buying um, the, the hardware, which I don't know what that does for anyone. But um, there are people are actually quite split online. Some people are saying, why are you making an entire video dedicated to somebody? Are you trying to be a clout chaser? And then you have other people who are obviously supporting Nene saying that you know they're not really surprised. This has happened before with other YouTubers, it's happening again. They I thought I was lying or I was trying to book you for £87.95, at the time, why didn't you say anything? Because this was purchased on the 3rd of February, so I'm confused. It's what now? What's the date? The 6th of March. Why is it only now? I've been to your house like twice, is it? I've been to you. The reason you gave me your password is because you wanted a little alibi story to fit this conspiracy that I hacked your account because I know your password. 
about this Maggie Mayhem situation. It's a consistent pattern. Renee obviously was tweeting that she doesn't really care, she's not giving energy to it anymore, she's focusing on herself, focusing on her grind. One thing I do like, one thing I do like about Renee recently is that I've seen that she is posting a lot of videos, her consistency is definitely up there and she's definitely proving herself to be a new kind of upcoming strong YouTuber from London, from the London scene. So obviously I big you up for that. But at the same time, did you obviously trick of this person who was your friend? The video the video that you that you guys did together was deleted. You know, did you set it up? We don't know. That is completely a whole different side of the story. Nene to me comes across somebody who is grounded, somebody who is really just telling her truth and telling her, giving her a, a real perception. She doesn't seem as somebody who would be a clout chaser. But at the same time, why are you making a video dedicated to just one person? Why, why would you do that for? Like, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, but at the same time, then perhaps you're using this to be a cloud chaser. We, you just don't know. But I just want to make this video to obviously explain both sides of the situation. Do you think Renee was completely wrong? Or do you think she was in the wrong Nene? And do you think that she was obviously lying about all of this? Or do you think that obviously Renee actually maybe did set it up and did, you know, ask her to put her password in so that she, she can use that ammunition in the future to say she can hack to account that she's fake and she's a traitor and give me ammunition to this. And apparently the story times have been fake from Renee and everything. And Nene just really just kind of exposing all of it, to be honest. And it's actually quite weird because she's getting backlash for it but at the same time she was she was getting support people just don't know but um this was a random kind of youtube kind of beef between these two particular individuals that we never really saw coming um we did see nene on her channel together where they did their mock bands and everything and uh, if a friendship's growing and you feel like you've set up you're going to be irritated you're going to be triggered and you want to obviously reflect and let people know probably why she made the video but at the same time we don't know Renee's side of the story so therefore this all this will this all, all of this could just be a lie we just we just don't know but i wanted to make this video so you guys can comment down below and let me know what you guys think about this entire debacle and the situation have you watched nene's video be sure to be sure to subscribe to both Nene's and Renee's channel and definitely subscribe to my channel too I massively appreciate it hit me up on my Instagram at Murad underscore Murali and definitely comment down below I'm looking forward to all your comments about this entire situation because it's actually quite tricky and weird and I'll catch you guys soon